Right now we are in Prachuap Kirikan. It's a province just south of Bangkok. A very small province, not many tourists here at all. It's a beautiful sunny day and we are going out to explore the town. So this is the military base area here. Not even a single person on the beach. So beautiful. And you have all these beautiful islands and the beach just stretches out all the way across the entire town. Look at that. I don't know what to call it. Town, city, small city, big town. I don't know, but this place is epic. So we rented a motorbike while we're here because it is a bit cheaper than Chumpon. It's 200 baht a day for a scooter. The guy that we rented from is super nice. We've rented it for two days. We'll put the uh, number and location of the guy that we rented from down below in the description. Look at the size of these fish. Yo, I think this is Saba. Some beautiful monuments like this and the whole town is just super clean. So clean and beautiful. First impressions of this place are really nice, right? Yeah. All kinds of stuff you can buy here. Don't get me started with, with all of these <laughs> things because we can barely carry our bags. <laughs> I really can't stop but look at this yeah. temple at um, the very top. I don't know if you guys can see that. There's a temple on top of the mountain. We might even go there. Yeah, we'll go there eventually. I've heard there's monkeys in there. I think there's a lot of monkeys around here. Another really beautiful monument. I think it's some kind of temple. Yeah. Just so well looked after. We kind of miss Buddhist temples. We haven't seen Buddhist temples in about three months now. Yeah. And it's kind of nice for a change, you know? So we were driving around and all we could see was only noodle shops at this time of the day so we just came back to the market and we're gonna eat something in here some um, insects? yeah just like quite a few insects we might try Twenty baht. these are delicious by the way we tried these in laos remember this one 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 Look at the size of these cockroaches, guys. It's, they are massive. Would you wow. like to try cockroach? Maybe not right now. I want some yeah. actual food. Okay. Not to say you that's not actual back. food, yeah. but pretty good. it's pretty crazy. What's this? This is... It's a... Seafood? Spicy. Fish egg. Egg, egg. egg. Oh, okay. Octopus, octopus, octopus egg, egg. Yeah. okay. Oh. Octopus egg, we never tried that. That looks so good. Mm. Wow. Is this pork? Pork. Yes. pork. Right. I bet you want that, don't yeah. you? Yeah. How much? 45. 45. 45. Okay, okay. should you try one? Very cheap, yeah. Okay, can I have one? One chicken maybe? Yeah, one chicken. This one, look, the chicken looks so delicious, guys. There's so much juice, proper barbecue. Look, he's putting this right from this big sauce. It goes right from here onto this. I mean, look at that. You can get this massive piece of chicken for just $2. Wow. 65 bucks. Get it. Spicy. Oh, very spicy. Good. Look at that spicy sauce. Oh, spicy. Wow. Oh, that's a lot of chili in here. <laughs> Maybe we should try some of that with the barbecue. Wow, we are loaded with food right now. <laughs> so much food, and it, as you can see, they look so freaking good. Now wow. we're looking for a place to have like a little picnic. Yeah. Yeah. Wow, they even have noodles for 10 baht. No way. Oh. No way. That is so cheap. Kemba for a pad thai. I think we're gonna it's love really it good. here. It's really good. So wait, are they? So what is that? Is that this is real? A, Not real. No, it's a ball. It's a BB gun. Oh, okay. Look, these are real guns. No. Yeah. No way. These are real bullets. Really? Mario's found his favorite stall in the market. Yeah, these are like really good guns. The gun and knife stall. Yeah, so basically this guy sells guns and katanas. And bongs actually. <laughs> and bongs as well. Because they all there. go well together, you know. So we've been walking for about 15 minutes in this market and it, we're getting overwhelmed of how many cool things there are. Like so many, all the 90s, Tupac, Eminem and all that. It's pretty cool, like Felipe has found like a cool bum bag. I find like a really cool hat, 
Some pretty cool trousers. Really nice. You know, and shorts. Like actually stuff that we would wear. We are pretty jeans. picky when it comes to, to clothes. Six dollars for a pair of yeah, jeans. Yeah, it seems like we have a lot of cool stuff. Is that real? This is, yeah, this is real crocodile's head. Yeah. And basically it's crocodile barbecue. I like to try, I never tried crocodile barbecue. A gator barbie. It looks good. Is that gator eggs? I think they are. I think they're alligator eggs. Wow. Never tried crocodile. Maybe we, should, we should come back and try. Yeah. Definitely. We're in a tie. Yeah. yeah so when we were in thailand last time with olivia we were actually vegetarian that was about three years ago we're not anymore basically living in laos for two years sort of changed us and we just started and eating meat basically yeah. now thailand feels like a completely different country yeah. there's so much pork shanks pork legs gators i'll eat it all man i'll literally eat it all there's nowhere else to sit and there's like a a whole massive like a uh, eating area and yeah we're just gonna crack on with the food that we got from the market got some coke i just love how in thailand you get the coke in a glass bottle just like in the 90s or something it's proper nice we're gonna try this pork right now oh the one that you saw like super super juicy mm, it's like sweet mm, that's perfect amount of salt wow all of this was around just under 200 baht for the rice the sauce loads of meat which is like less than seven dollars mm. so cheap six dollars even this is like food for the day we kind of overbought so this market has like a lot of stages there's like fairgrounds and all kind of things and the best part is that there's an actual muay thai ring just there yeah we don't know if this is usually here. It looks like there's a special event happening. But we were talking to some Thai people. They said it's tonight and it's free. It's free. Travels on Where'd like you get Muay Thai things. for free, right? This is crazy. So it starts at... Half five. Half past five or six o'clock. I'm not sure. But yeah. Most of the writing's in Thai, so we're not really sure what it is. But I'm guessing so, it's like... This is the, the fighters, probably yeah, the people fighters. fighting against other people. This is the ring. Probably gonna come here, sit down, bring some drinks, probably, right? Yeah, get some beer, maybe some crazy snacks from the market yeah. just here. Um, it's gonna be fun. Yeah, it's gonna be really fun. I don't think if we're gonna cover all of this in this video, so you're gonna have to watch the next one in order to see what we do here, watching Muay Thai, maybe getting some insects fun. and stuff like that. Where are we going now? Now we're gonna go and explore a little bit of that beach area. We still haven't been to the beach properly and beach is probably one of the best things here in, in this town, Prachuap. So this whole area is a sort of military controlled area. It's sort of like an airspace in here. Um, I have been here in 2016 hitchhiking. At the time I didn't know what I was until we got back here and then I looked and I was like we were here before with this like Thai family that like picked us up in this random village and drove us here except that back in the days this area was only allowed for authorized military people you had to have a pass you have to have like a military pass so yeah. the people who were taking us on this on this hitch, hitch, hitchhike ride he had like a military pass because he was a soldier so he let us in and we were like wow we originally were so lucky to be here but now in 2022 it's open for everybody to come and check this place out so tourism is allowed regular people are allowed there's quite a few rules that you have to follow so you're not supposed to film certain things like uh, the airport runways and stuff like that or military personnel you're not allowed to bring your pets yeah. there's a few rules you should there's only, follow there's only one road you can drive on but i mean when you enter there's a whole map the uh yeah. the guy at the the front will direct you to it to check the rules before you come in because you don't want to get into trouble filming something you shouldn't be filming or going yeah. somewhere you shouldn't be so yeah keep that in mind but i think this is one of the most beautiful areas in all of yeah. prachuap kiritan really it's is wow so finally we're here at the beach it's called Almanau. i can't believe it's been six years i had a selfie of this location with this family that drove us here as you can see right now and i never knew the name of this place and i generally thought that i'm never gonna be back to this place and guess what we're here we're in Almanau. boom look at that beach Quite a lot of locals here. I think they come here. It's a good spot. I can see why. I mean, look at that. It's no wonder everyone's here. Look at the 
trees lining the beach and the mountains. And to be honest, it's not that busy at all. I wouldn't say it's many people, just a few. Yeah. It's, I mean, for the size of the beach, it's barely anyone. Uh, but I mean, look at the view. Wow. All the islands and the mountains. And the craziest thing, you know, like there's like a lot of monkeys and deer and whatnot. Yeah. Someone's got a jet ski there. Yeah. <laughs> People are having fun. So you can literally come here. You can bring your own beers. You can order some food. You can even get a massage here. Well, what a spot to just chill with your mates, right? They do sell all kinds of stuff here as well. And there is a market like over there. So you could buy some food and come and sit here. But this is such a spot. I think me and Mario are going to come back here and spend the whole day in one yeah. of these little, under these little umbrellas. And we're thinking of even having a day off YouTube. You just have one day where we're not filming. I'm sure you can guys understand that. We also have a bit of a life where we just want to not film and just you know just enjoy for ourselves but who knows we might film it as well we might consider it there's really not any tourism here at all we've seen a couple of foreigners today just mainly local thai people mainly local thai people all right let's let's go and see some here. animals now yeah that's what we're here for we got a tuk tuk this way and we spotted a few animals so we thought we'd come back and look oh my gosh i've never been this close to deer before yeah wow, wow. well you're gonna have to give the bananas i think this is crazy. There you go. Ah, good boy. Just like that. Wow. <laughs> what about yeah. the baby one? Little baby, where's the baby? Oh no, he's gonna get crushed. <laughs> Can you give it to the baby? I'll distract him now. Just it's hard to distract Give it, him. give it, give it. No, he's not gonna. Oh, the baby doesn't get in time. No. Give it to the baby, man. They're so mean to the children. This is so unfair. Let me feed the baby. Look, one just escaped. Hello. <laughs> He's already eating here, the one that we just got him. I like it, buddy. Mario, 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 yeah. Mario. Whoa! <laughs> what? I was like, what? The, who the hell is this guy? It's massive. Looks like a dinosaur, seriously. It literally looks like it's not from this planet. What? <laughs> Crazy. Big ass bird. Look at it. What? What? There we go. Olivia's feeding it. Oh, oh. it. Let's go feed the goatee now. Hey, you have goat? Are you hungry? Oy. Mario's just dropped all of the goat feed. <laughs> if you push it that way, they'll eat it. It's all good. Oi! <laughs> Oi, eh? No, 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 you're not getting any more birds. Greedy! So, so far, Prachuap Kirikan is just amazing. Like, we are loving this place. There's so many more things to see and do. We just can't cover everything in all, all in one video. <laughs> Sorry, it's because you can see him trying to put his tongue out. <laughs> Hey, stop hitting other, other friends, mate. You're gonna have to live with them. What are you doing, Olivia? I'm petting a deer. Oh, wow. Good deer. I'm stroking like it's a dog, you know? It's crazy. Wow. <laughs> I, I don't have any words. This is just crazy. There's a, there's a giant dinosaur bird behind you. Like, He's I coming. Just... He's coming for you. Look at his mouth. Like, he could reach you from miles away. It's way bigger than it looks like on a camera. He walks with like sass, don't you think? Yeah. Proper sassy walk. He's like just swaggering yeah. in there between the deer. It genuinely looks like a dinosaur. And I mean, ostriches are the largest birds still alive. Oh, she, he's going for the girl's hat. <laughs> to see those animals didn't cost us anything. You just pay 20 baht for a bowl of food. So if, that's if you want to feed them. Yeah, if you want to feed them. So you can just come and look at them completely for free. I love how everything yeah. is free. In, because this Catch place up. is not dominated by Western tourism, so that's yeah. why I said of the prices are more for like local people, and you know we love that because it's just so cheap, and you can get to see so many things and not spend any money. Just here is a horse riding kind of area, so you can come horse riding and stuff, which is really cool. Yeah. Archery. Yeah. I love archery. Let's go find out how much it is. Yeah. So I dig up. So here's shooting some bow and arrow. Looks interesting. I always wanted to try. It says one set is 100 baht. So it's quite cheap. Why do you want to try? One set is like a set of arrows. Hmm. I'd like to try. Yeah, let's give it a go. One, one set. One set. Five feet. Oh, five. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Five times. Five. Five arrows. Is 100 baht. Yes. So, uh -huh. Okay. Okay. 
You're going for the far away? Yeah. Okay. Over here. Whoa! He got it on on the white at the top, but, but I didn't get any points. It's white, so I missed it. <laughs> Try and get it in the the center, the red center. Oh, Whoa! Yes, better. Got it in the yellow. Yeah, now I need so to shoot nearly some more far away from me. Wow! Nice one. First well, time. You got good aim. I'm getting into it, eh? Wow. Pretty good for your first time. Well, if there was an actual deer running around, I don't think I'd have a lot of <laughs> More, 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 more. As much as... Okay, go for it. Shoot. Ooh, nice. For the first time. Olivia feels like she's in Hunger Games. Living out my dream. Whoa, that was gonna be very I'm good. Bouncing off. I just bounce off, yeah. You don't like me. Hey, missed it. <laughs> I haven't got that upper body strength yet. Need to go back to the gym. <laughs> we finished all of our arrows. And it was only three dollars for the whole thing. Me and Oliver just here for half an hour shooting. Three dollars. You could just spending be spending all day just here shooting arrows, having yeah, beers. Practicing. Man, brought you up, Kiri Khan. We love you, man. This is really sick. This whole street through the military base that you drive along is full of fun activities to do. Yeah. Next stop? Yep. Where? I don't know. Do you want to try some quads? Three hundred. How long time? Uh, How long time? Uh, uh, Sip half. 15 minutes so yeah it's 15 minutes for 300 baht which is ten dollars and you drive like around like a massive track in there so you just kind of go through like the forest and whatnot so it's pretty cool especially if you come like a group of friends that would be really cool if you go on your own it's kind of heh but I think the price is really good. 300 baht is not expensive. It's actually pretty cheap. So as you can see, guys, there is a lot to do. Even just on this street through the military base, there's a golf course, horse riding, archery, quad bikes, beaches. You like, name it. It's so, so much fun. Yeah, too many things. <laughs> it is really, really awesome. Um, we thinking of him staying here a little bit longer for maybe extra couple days or something like that because we really love it here and uh, tonight we're gonna go watch that Muay Thai that we talked about earlier um, you're gonna be able to see this all in next video uh, as you could probably understand this video is becoming longer and longer so we're probably gonna end it here and as always if you guys enjoyed watching this video hit a like button because it really helps us out yeah and subscribe if you haven't already and we'll see you in the next one at Muay Thai oh yeah <laughs>